how you can draw your ionic compounds. Just as a quick recap. Uh, so in your near port, you can see the top left hand corner, there is this uh, image over there, right, that's being inserted. So you can go ahead and tap it and then you'll see this thing popping up. Okay, so this is our, our notes, right, the things that I have reminded you before on what you need to take note. Okay, so if you need it, you can tap on that. If not, you can uh, retract the question and then this is the canvas that you're going to work with. Okay, so first and foremost, please write down the chemical formula of the substance. So in this case, it's uh, calcium oxide. It is a uh, ionic compound, so CaO. Okay, then we will go on to look at the electronic configuration. So by now, you should be able to do this very quickly, right? Calcium is 2.8.8.2. You will lose two electrons to form uh, calcium cation, Ca2+. And then oxygen will gain two electrons to form oxide anion, O2-. Okay, so then we always begin by drawing the um, cation, so in this case, calcium, right? So we will draw 2.8.8. .8. So there are three electron shells, and then you fill it all up, okay? Because it has already uh, formed the stable cation. Okay, so draw in the square bracket, and then remember to put the correct charge. In this case, it's 2 plus. Next, we look at the anion, which is oxide, O2 minus. Okay, so again, remember anion, very important. You must follow the convention. Right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, you should end up with such a configuration. And then the two electrons that are being gained is not from oxygen, it's from calcium, so you need to use the cross. Okay, then complete the diagram with the square bracket and the correct charge, which is two minus. And then finally, you end off with the legend. Okay, so if you are very confused with symbols, I suggest you write the legend at the start. But for me, because I'm comfortable already, the legend is just there uh, as a reference. Okay, so if you have done with this, then this is a straightforward two ticks, two marks. Okay, this is a good answer. So once you're done, you can just submit, put a smiley face, and yeah, two marks. Okay, hope this helps.